Hey, it's David with FarmHQ. I'm here in my workshop tonight to give you a quick demonstration of how pump controls work in the FarmHQ app. To do that, I've got this TC3 device wired up to a simple aquarium pump here. This is actually really similar to how you would wire an electric pump in the field. Um, essentially, the circuit for this aquarium pump is wired through the normally open contacts on the TC3. Anytime that switch is activated, the pump will turn on, and anytime the switch is deactivated, the pump turns off. So to demonstrate how that works in the app, I've got my iPad running the FarmHQ app here, and I'm going to save a recording, uh, which you'll see on the screen over here. So to get started, I'm going to tap on Aquarium Pump. I'll go to Controls, and I'm going to tap on Activate Switch for 10 seconds. So when I submit that, water is automatically going to turn on. It's going to run for exactly 10 seconds, and after 10 seconds, it's automatically going to turn off. That should happen, I don't know, right about now? Great. Okay. Um, obviously, we'd want to turn on, in the real world, our irrigation uh, for more than 10 seconds. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Activate Switch, click on Submit, and again, that's going to go up to the cloud, come down to the device, and the switch turns on, the water starts. So to turn the water off, I could click on Deactivate Switch, and that would turn the pump off in real time. Um, but one thing I want to show you is one feature of the new Quick Scheduler feature that we just launched. This gives you the ability to set a delayed shutdown on this pump. And so in order to do that, I'm going to tap on Delayed Shutdown. What I want to do is deactivate the switch today at uh, 9.18 p.m., which is one minute in the future. Tap on Submit. Great. And at 9.18 p.m., let's go ahead and look at the world clock. It looks like we've got about 25 seconds to go. So I'm going to sit here, maybe play some interesting music for you. All right, so we've got about 10 seconds to go. Cool thing about this feature is that timer is automatically synced down to this device. So even if for some reason it can't connect to the cellular network, it will still turn off automatically precisely at the time that you set in the app. So that's just one aspect of Quick Scheduler. Quick Scheduler also allows you to set one-time irrigation sessions so that you can start and stop a pump at a specific set of times, or you can set recurring schedules so you can plan out your entire week, month, or even your entire season with FarmHQ. So um, I'm going to go over those features in detail in a later video, but for now, that's basically it. Uh, thanks for watching and have a good evening.